we'll see a question on set. The question says, in a group of 15 pupils, 7 can read French and 8 can read English, while 3 of them cannot read any of these two languages. So how many people can exactly read one language? This is a question and we have answer option. So we'll see the solution now. Now this says, these are 15 people, 1 to 15. Now it is said that three people cannot read any language. So we leave out these three, 13, 14 and 15. Now seven are reading French. So one, two, seven, we mark here as French readers. Then eight are reading English. So we mark people who read English from this end. So in this diagram, you can see that there are few people who are reading both the languages. These three are reading both the languages. So people who are reading only one language are four here and five here. So when you add four and five, the answer is nine. So there are nine people who are reading only one language. So hope it is clear. Now there's a small doubt. I'll clarify. Like somebody might say that why we have not counted people who are reading French and English from this end. The answer is that there are total 12 people who are reading both the language. So if we count French and English from one end, then we'll have four more people who, who are not reading actually any language. But as per question, there are only three people who are actually not able to read any of the language. So that is why we are counting people who are reading French from this end and people who are reading English from this end. So that's all. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching.